action. The Tigers meet Hawthorne on Saturday, knowing the four points is a must after its opening round loss to Essendon. Let's cross live to Richmond Training and our new reporter, former 237-game veteran for Footscray in Sydney, Neil Cordy. Welcome, Neil. Thanks, Steve. How are the Tigers looking? Yeah, they look terrific. An unusual situation out here at Waverley because Richmond and Hawthorne, who meet this Saturday, are training back-to-back. -back. Richmond were out here at about 3 o'clock and Hawthorne are out there at the moment. Well, Richmond might have lost last week, but there were plenty of positive signs, particularly the performance of Matty Richardson. Yeah, outstanding. I think he surprised everybody, and including himself, with uh, his six-goal effort. Coming back from such a serious injury, it was uh, an outstanding performance. He certainly is a great player, and he certainly proved that on the weekend. Wayne Campbell, of course, a big bonus for the Tigers back after suspension. Certainly. They really missed him on the weekend against Essen, and his uh, value in the midfield would be uh, tremendous, and he'll be a great uh, asset this weekend. 420 kicks last year, the top in the league. Uh, They'll really enjoy his uh, performance on the weekend. Uh, you'd... Last year, which was the first time they'd won the opening game in 10 years, and it really is an important game to win, but now they're in, in, in the danger of uh, losing possibly the first two. And some people said Richmond perhaps overachieved last year. How do you see it? Well, I think, uh, yeah, I was one of those that thought uh, the Tigers had performed better than uh, they really were. And it'll be a very interesting thing to see if they can uh, follow up that performance. For, uh, fourth last year, uh, I'm not sure whether they can match that this year. Neil, well done and welcome aboard. Thanks, Steve.